Hello, we've connected to the mannequin. We're going to go into the controlled session. Only one instructor at a time gets to be in there. And what I'd like to do is open a new session and go through the different buttons in that new session. So we'll go through quickly and pick our parameters hit the start button and now it takes us to the instructors view first thing I want to note is at the top we see that we're on Ambu Man Advanced and we have a full battery charge across the top we have our event buttons and, you can, and they're stored alphabetically and you can add as many as you want and toggle back and forth. Now I want to go through these buttons right here. So this button is a sound button. It allows you to access the sound menu. You can select it and hit start. You also have the ability to change the volume. That speaker's in the chest of the mannequin. To make this menu go away, or any of the menus, click on them again they turn green and go away. This next button is your ECG rhythms. Um, you have active rhythm on top, again drop downs. Um, you can go through and select any rhythm you want. Uh, in this particular scenario, VFib course is selected. Um, you have the ability on the fly to change frequency and amplitude. Um, you also have the ability as you go through a scenario to change these rhythms. When you change the rhythm to make that rhythm take effect on the mannequin, you have to hit the start button. Um, you also have a defib rhythm, so if we're in a scenario that requires defibrillation, you have the ability upon defib to have no selected rhythm, or you can actually change to any of these other rhythms, or pick none out of the drop-down. Um, when the wave generator generates a rhythm that would generate a pulse or you would expect a pulse you automatically get an electronic carotid pulse on the mannequin. You also have the ability to superimpose a loose electrode tracing over any rhythm, a muscle tremor or no defib effect. To make that go away you click on it if you want to get back in, you click on it again. This next button is your uh, vital signs, um, NIBP, SPO2, and tidal CO2, and breathing. Those show up during a live scenario down here. Now note that these mannequins, all the wireless mannequins, are compliant with the January 30, 2019 AHA mandate that states that you need to have visual or audible um, instant feedback for compression rate um, and depth. So this mannequin is compliant right now. Um, you can adjust any of these values as you see fit live and on the fly click on it, it goes away. This button starts your scenario and this button um, is the way to end a scenario. It's a doorway and we're going to close the door.